Later, buddy. Hey, handsome, looking for a ride? Good morning, Lynn. Morning. So, Antonio, you ready to do this? Hell yeah. Can you believe it finally stopped raining? Yeah, I know. It's perfect. It's going to be beautiful. <laughs> Man, Antonio, you picked the perfect day to do this thing. Yeah, Glenn. You know, it's been a while since we've gone on a hiking trip together. It sure is going to be nice to get out of the city for a change. Yeah, you got that one. Please don't go, Mama, please don't go, Mama, please don't go. That was the latest hit from the talented Vemi Anya. Yeah, I sure love her style, and she's beautiful too. There just aren't that many female rockers out there anymore. You go, girl. Speaking of beautiful, it's sure shaping up to be a gorgeous day. I knew I should have called in sick. Now I'm stuck here in the studio with your sorry ass. <laughs> <laughs> well, get used to it because another nasty storm front is on its way, possibly arriving late tomorrow afternoon and continuing into the evening. This is now officially Los Angeles' second wettest rainfall season since records began in 1877 and the wettest in 121 years. The most rain to fall in a rain season was 38.18 inches during the 1883-1884 season. How about that? So how's April doing? She's all right. Man, I love her so much, but sometimes she gets on my nerves, you know what I mean? Well, you know how she is. <sighs> anyway, I just need to get away from her, you know? Clear my mind. Spend some quiet time with my best friend. A guy's day out. Yeah, guy's day out. No girls allowed. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with the little mill bonding. Besides, a relaxing picnic out in the country is gonna hopefully cure us from that cabin fever. Ah, uh, to be one with nature. Uh, by the way, um, do you remember to bring the... Uh, Beer? Yeah. I got it. <laughs> Good. Uh, how about your candy? You remember to bring that? Yeah. I'll take some great photos. And it'll be awesome. this out, Glenn. I love you. Oh, God, okay? not this again. I love you, Amy. I love you, too. But if we get married, how, how are we going to support a family or buy a house with our combined incomes, huh? I'm not going to live. I don't want to live the rest of my life in, a, in an apartment. I know. I know. I don't want that either. You know, like I've said before, if we move in together, we can save a lot of money on rent. I can't do that until I'm married to you. You know this. My parents will disown me. Gosh. Look at Antonio. Glenn, I mean, please. He is younger than you are, and he already owns a condo. Can you not ask him for some advice? Antonio, Antonio, Antonio! I'm tired of the same old crap! Okay, okay, I'm sorry. Fine, whatever. 
Well, I suppose I could always get a second job. God, no. I'll do anything it takes to keep you. No second job. I'll never get to see you, and when I do, you'll be exhausted. Forget about it. It's not an option. But I make a good living. So do I. But good isn't great, Glenn. It just isn't enough. I just need something, something more. Huh, Glenn? What? Oh, sorry, I, I didn't hear that. Oh, uh, I said I'm getting hungry. Uh, did you bring any snacks for the road? Uh, of course. Uh, check behind me. Grab that can of potato chips. <laughs> oh, dude, that look was priceless. <laughs> Asshole. That was good. I have to admit, that was damn good. You got me there. <laughs> no, seriously, yeah. Uh, check out that other bag. <laughs> damn, I found the mother load. <laughs> Wake up, we're here. Oh, oh man. Oh, I'm not used to waking up so early. <laughs> oh, dude, what happened? Ah, so that's real funny. You just wait, I'll get you. <laughs> no more. <laughs> I'm sorry, no more, I promise. <laughs> uh, uh, well, let's hit the trail. <laughs> I'm getting kind of hungry. How about we break for a little lunch? No, no, let's keep going up further. Okay. Anything you say. Oh, no, no, no. Don't tell me you brought that thing. Oh, yeah. Oh. I gotta get in a little practice. Give my neighbors a break. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey, Glenn, how about those rocks over there? That looks like a cool place to eat. Hey, I bet you there's a great view from up there. All right. Over there, that was a good spot. Man. What the hell? That looks like... Oh my god, is it? What? What is it? Oh my god, it is! Look, Antonio, look what I found! What? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Gold? <laughs> you found gold? Where'd you find it? Right here, I can't believe it. It was just it was just half sticking up out of the dirt. Well you think there's any more? What do I find out? No, 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 you know what? I don't think there's any more. I think that was the last of it. Have you ever seen anything like it? Oh, no. Oh, man. Look at the size of this thing. We're in the middle of nowhere, and you find gold? <laughs> gold! I mean, that's like winning the lottery. Yes! Oh, I wonder how much this baby's worth. <laughs> shh, 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 shh. Quiet. Quiet down. We don't want anyone else to hear us up here, okay? You don't think anybody else is hiking up this trail, do you? I think we're safe. I, I gotta sit down. Think this thing through. <laughs> I can't believe it. Must be worth a fortune. I guess from all the rain that we've been getting, it washed away from the erosion. Yeah. Yeah, that must be it. I'm surprised no one else found it. Yeah, me too. So the saying really is true. There really is gold in them Nair Hills. <laughs> we are in the state of California, the golden state. <laughs> hey. Do you have any idea where exactly where we're at? I mean, do you think this is private property? Oh, hell no. Screw that, man. Finders keepers. Wait a second. If this is state property or national park, you're not supposed to remove anything from the land. Like I said, finders keepers. No one needs to know anything about this. Nothing. Understand? So what are you going to do? Sell it? Of course. You mean you're going to walk straight into some place and plop down this monster nugget? Right. 
gonna attract attention. People are gonna ask questions. Uh, they're gonna ask where you found it. Lucy, you got a lot of explaining to do. Well, I can cut it up, sell it off in chunks. All right? Yeah. Yeah. Just think. Finally, get a house of my own. Shoot my girl, right? <laughs> Trade in my classic 1990 Honda Accord. <laughs> I'm just so sick of always having to worry about money, never having enough. Well, no more. Finally, a true American can live the American dream. Thank God Almighty, I'm free at last! I wonder how much an ounce of gold is selling these days. Oh, I don't know. I'm, I'm gonna have to uh, research it on the internet. I'll um, uh, check the stock exchange. I don't know, I'm so excited. I can't think straight. Maybe we gotta head back. Yeah, I think so. Listen, I don't know about you, but I'm feeling a little paranoid. I'm still worried that we may be trespassing on private property, and I don't wanna get caught stealing. Yeah, okay, okay, but uh, tell me, uh, how many uh, ounces in a pound, 16? I don't know. I have no idea. Damn, it's too bad because it's so damn heavy, too. <laughs> oh, really? How heavy? Here, let me take a look at it. Antonio, where are you going? Antonio, wait! Antonio! Wait up! Antonio! Antonio!
I'll get you. Hey, it's Antonio. Why? Why? Why, goddammit? Why are you late? It's about 6 a.m. You know how long it takes to drive up there? I'm waiting outside. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I see you. There you are. I see you coming down the road now. Later, buddy. Friday, 6.02 a.m. Glenn, it's me, April. How was your trip? Well, I guess you know by now. Oh my god, I wish I was there to see your expression. You have no idea how long Antonio planned this thing, especially for today. <laughs> Anyways, April Fool's Gold. Get it?
April Fool's. <laughs> Fool's gold. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>